Hello everyone, I have a, another precious thing to share with you today and this one is um, from Tina Lady and how pretty is the bag? Look at that little stamp she's got down there, it says Hummingbird Tales and this is from the UK and there's a piece of washi tape on the back, but uh, I will need to cut that, I think. Okay. Right, and we have, we have a note, just um, let me read it. Uh, okay. Uh, Oh, okay, this is a card and that's the continuation, so that's a beautiful card, isn't it? It's like a, a portrait. Is it? It is, it's a Monet. Oh, how lovely. Isn't that beautiful? Very beautiful. And... Okay, oh, see? There's a lot to be reading in here, so just let me make sure there's no details or anything. And I will read it out. Dearest Jeanette, hello all the way from Cornwall. Uh, is that southwest England? Firstly, I want to thank you for all of your wonderful videos. You are a huge inspiration to me and I am really excited about your challenge and to see how you use all of the precious things in your precious booklet. I'm sending you three precious items of mine. I've been making junk journals since June and I have to say that I'm quite addicted to it. They're wonderful, aren't they? <laughs> and from this, my whole world has been opened up to all different crafts whilst using beautiful laces, fabrics and paper. Back to my precious things. I've sent you a piece of what was described as wedding silk fabric when out rummaging in a second hand shop. It really is beautiful but I'm oh but I'm convinced that it's modern. Okay, which is okay because it is gorgeous. Yeah, it doesn't really matter, does it? As long as it's beautiful. <laughs> I only have a fat quarter but wanted you to have some. Oh, that's so kind of you. Oh, that's very kind of you. And then I'm sending you one of my very precious doilies. I've got two of these left and they're precious to me because they're old incredibly delicate and so detailed. This was in a box of vintage doilies that my lovely husband bought for me for Christmas. How wonderful! These ladies that have husbands that buy them these things are so jealous. My, I don't, don't think mine would... he might. Uh, I won't say never. So those are the reasons why it's precious to me. Yes, indeed, very, very precious when your husband buys you something that you really enjoy and like. And lastly, I'm sending you a small piece of what was described as authentic Edwardian silk fabric. I think you'll agree, it was so delicate. It's like tissue paper and is so very, very beautiful. I've still got a little bit left of of this which I'm not going to alter but keep and perhaps make a precious booklet myself or put it in one of my favorite journals. I really hope that you enjoy my precious things. Oh, almost forgot this silk is also precious to me because I love Jane Austen and it was my best it was my best friend who in, introduced me to Pride and Prejudice and Emma, the film versions, yes, I love them. Um, we watched as many films and TV at a, I think, is it adaptation, uh, ad, adaptations of Jane Austen's stories and never get bored of the fabulous characters and beautiful dresses 
hats and fashion. Sorry, I just need to turn my fan on. It just got really, really hot. Um, beautiful dresses, hats and fashion in general. Oh, and they're beautiful homes. Even the little cottage in Sense and Sensibility starring Emma Thompson and Kate Winslet was amazing and that family was supposed to be quite poor. I know, I loved that little cottage. Absolutely love cottages. It all takes me away into another world and there's always a happy ending. My best friend lives in Wales and we're hopeless with keeping in touch, even by text and email, but we both hold each other dearly in our hearts and we see each other three or four times a year. So this piece of Edwardian silk represents everything Edwardian to do with Jane Austen and my friendship with my best friend, who I also consider as my sister. So there we have it. Thank you for setting this challenge, Jeanette, and I'm incredibly happy to share these precious things of mine with you, Tina. Well, isn't that wonderful? Thank you so much for all of that. Wow, look, it, it's huge, isn't it? It's just lovely. Wow. Ah, oh, that's really lovely. And I love those movies as well myself, as I'm sure so many other people do. And they do, they take us to a different time and place. A bit of an escape, isn't it? And that's perhaps why we like playing with our old um, laces and doilies so much. I love your little, um, your little bag here. It's that baking paper to your coffee dyed stained. It's just beautiful, isn't it? Oh, thank you. I just used a little bit of double-sided tape so that that is easy to come out. And she's addicted to making journals at the moment. Isn't that lovely? Thank you for that. Okay, so... Sorry, I got really hot. Um, the first thing... Okay. Oh, she's not. Yep. Okay. So this is the wedding fabric, the silk or satin, and she said it was. She said it was um, wedding silk fabric. She thinks it's modern, but it's. It doesn't matter because it's beautiful anyway. And I'm a bit like that too. As long as I like it, it doesn't matter whether it's new or old, really, does it? So I want to keep the tissue paper she's sent this in because it's really pretty with the little dragonflies on. I will be careful. Isn't that tissue paper just lovely with the little dragonflies on? It's really lovely. Oh, isn't that beautiful? So it is, it's a piece of satin, but look at the beautiful embroidery on it. That's just beautiful. Isn't that lovely? That really is quite beautiful, and that would probably make a lovely pocket, because you wouldn't want to cut it any smaller than what it is, would you? Oh, that's lovely. Thank you so much, Tina. And she found this while she was out rummaging. That's beautiful. And the, the second one is Precious Doily. And they're precious to her because they're old, incredibly delicate, and so detailed. It's like a little mystery, isn't it? Mm. It's just... I can open it properly a bit later. Oh, wow, isn't that beautiful? Oh, my goodness me! 
that is so fine. Look how fine that is. Oh, wow. Look at that. Have I got it right? I've got it the wrong way. <laughs> it's so small and I've even got my good glasses on too. Oh, wow. That is so very, very fine. Look at that work. Oh wow, oh that's just beautiful isn't it, oh I love that, thank you so much Tina, I, oh goodness those little stitches are so tiny, wow, thank you so much for sharing that, that is beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? And look at these little flowers. Wow. That's amazing. Thank you so much. That's beautiful. And, oh dear. Uh, and then the third is a small piece of what was described as authentic Edwardian silk fabric. And it reminds her of. Jane Austen um, and then of course the the, tr the precious times she spent with her friend um, because they both have a love of the Jane Austen movies and oh, isn't that lovely to read all of that so she has a piece for herself she's kept some for herself it's like tissue. Oh, I'm so excited to see it now. Oh, wow. It's, <laughs> you can't even feel it. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? And that's the back of it. Just for those that might be curious. And you can see where the threads have gone from one to the next one as well. Oh, it's just beautiful, Tina. Look at these lovely little flowers down the bottom, these little tiny ones here. That is simply beautiful. Oh, that is so kind of you to share those things with me. And aren't they just exquisite? So very, very lovely. And your lovely explanation of why everything is so very precious to you, I really do appreciate that and you know when you have a friend and you don't see them very often as soon as you see them the time seems a little bit irrelevant doesn't it i have a sister and i rarely see her but when we do get together it, it's like we, we just pick up where we left off really um or it has been over the years so you know which is a lovely thing and you have more to talk about <laughs> Thank you so much, Tina, for your absolutely gorgeous, precious things. I'm so touched that you would share those with me. That is really, really lovely. And the story, you know, the explanation itself is just, it's precious as well. And I do appreciate that. I appreciate it very much. So thank you, everybody, for watching. And thank you, Tina, once again, for your very beautiful one precious things and um the tissue paper too <laughs> i'll use those in a journal thank you take care everybody bye bye oh i have another one i have another one i will show you um before i go so we'll put those
those to one side over there and I have another one. Oh, and did I show you how she stained up all the envelope as well? I'll show you the back. Um, it's really quite beautiful. Even my daughter sort of commented how it was so nice to see, you know, just little touches on envelopes and things like that, how pretty and thoughtful it is. So thank you so much for that. Just put that over there. And the next one is from, I think it, it just says J Hutchison Brisbane. There's no actual complete address on it. precious thing is a doily that was my nan's. Oh, how lovely. I have two of them, so I am giving one to you. The tea strainer is a gift for you to make a pincushion. Thank you for all your videos, Jan. And, oh, okay, down the bottom she says, no YouTube. She just likes to watch. And there's a lot of people like that, isn't there? There's a lot of people who um, who just like to watch, and that's quite all right. Not everybody wants to be on the internet. So I love this paper. I've got a little bit of this paper myself. I, it's really pretty, isn't it? Look at this lace. Oops, did I just, oh, I just tied it in a knot. Isn't that lovely? Oh, look at that beautiful lace. That's beautiful. Thank you so much. It's lovely. Thank you. And she didn't stick this down, which is nice because I'll be able to use that again. Oh, look at so what did she say? The doily was her nan's. She has two and she's sharing one with me. Oh, there it is. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh, that's lovely. I love the colour of that. That's beautiful. Thank you so much for that, Jan. It's really lovely. Oh, you can tell this is the wrong way because it's got little threads at the back. It'd be a first, wouldn't it? And a doily. It's beautiful. Thank you so much. How lovely. Thank you. And the tea strainer is a gift for you to make a pincushion. Oh, that is so kind of you. Thank you. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, isn't that lovely? Such as put some lace in there. Oh, some blue lace. Oh, look at that, it's got a little basket. A little basket in it. Oh. oh, isn't that lovely? Oh, that is so sweet. Oh, I will love using that to make it cushion although I might make it so that I can remove it if I want to it's just isn't that cute that's oh, so sweet thank you so much for that that's so kind and you've also put a little bit of blue lace in for me isn't that lovely oh that is so kind of you thank you very much for that Jan 
It's really lovely. What a lovely little um, gift. Very thoughtful. And thank you so much for your beautiful one precious thing. Both from Jan and from T Oh, did you see it? It flies. It's so soft. And from Tina. Thank you ever so much, ladies. I do appreciate that. And thank you for taking part in the challenge. Take care and bye-bye.